Hey guys, so this is Flip Chips and welcome to another video. Uh, this is for Dragon Ball Super uh, episode 103. And this is just a short uh, summary and some of my thoughts on this episode this morning. Well, uh, if you have been watching uh, YouTube for, you know, very frequently, you must have uh, ran into some videos regarding, you know, summaries for episode, episode 103 and uh, it was actually a good episode. Uh, it wasn't as explosive as the previous one when uh, 17 was, you know, he was badass against the universe too. So, uh, uh, it, it is a good episode in its own right. It started with Goku and 17 of course, uh, against uh, Ribrian and Rosie, or Rosie, and it was a good fight. And Seventeen was still uh, really good. However, it seems uh, he and Ribrian are most likely evenly matched, and Rosie is giving Goku a hard time. But of course, uh, that changed. Uh, of course, uh, <clears throat> Goku is still holding back his power. But uh, I mean, in normal form, he can still eliminate people. And <clears throat> he he was able to you know, corner Roti, but Ribrian came in, came into the picture, and you know, of course tried to save Roti. And of course, it was about to happen. Goku and Seventeen was there trying to, you know, try to finish them off. But then they are dra <coughs> the tele the teleporter. That's what I call the are rats. Uh, they came into the uh, he came to the picture and saved Ribrian and Rosie. So it's back to square one again. So Goku and Seventeen parted ways, and then we get to see Gohan versus Botamo, or Botam Botamo, Botamo, and it it was a good match uh, match as well. Um, it wasn't as you know as exciting, but it was good. Uh, Gohan was able to beat Botamo, which you know. The match it didn't last long. As soon as Gohan caught Botamo floating because of the uh, continuous punches, uh, he was uh, he was able to eliminate Botamo, and it it wasn't uh, Botamo didn't have a chance at all. Uh, the, uh, yeah, it was good. Uh, it didn't really showcase. Gohan's power yet Not that much though, but still in that form Gohan was able to eliminate Botamo and everyone Who fought Botamo didn't had a chance because of you know The punches are just seemed to be bouncing off but because of Gohan's power He was able to lift Botamo and then uh, Gohan and Piccolo versus uh, the universe the last two members of the Universe 10 team. Uh, it was a good one as well. Uh, Piccolo beat his opponent easily. And then Gohan was faced with Ogni. Uh, which it's probably an illusion or uh, it's much like you know, split, splitting the body, splitting his body or yeah most likely it's, most likely it's an illusion to confuse the uh, opponent and uh, Gohan uh, probably had a problem at first so he raised his power and he was able to eliminate Obni and that's it for Universe 10 so uh, we are uh, at another crossroads we're in you know uh, the mood of the episode uh, Turned 
it's not actually worse, but it turned to something of a gloomy environment or, because another universe is erased. And as you can see, Gohan was standing uh, over a locket from Obni showing a picture of his family and then it's just erased. So are we going to see an explosion from Gohan like he did during his battle against Cell? And of course even Bojack. Uh, is he to protect the not not only the lives of the people of the universes but of course their memories as well you can see a gohan clench his fist um you know that emotion you know that sticks that sticks to you you know if you have been watching dragon ball ever since you know you've gr you've grown to n have known the characters that you're watching it's like you know so, uh, will he awaken in the end, um, like a new form? This is probably the same with Goku. So, Goku might um, awaken another form because of mostly, uh, most likely anger. And oh, we don't know much if they are able to do something against the gods, of course. Who has, you know, the ultimate power? I mean, just raising their hand erases universes. So, uh, we'll have to see. Uh, most likely, we still have lots more ep episodes to go before the tournament of power ends. So, basically, that's uh, the short summary for the episode. Um, and then, of course, we'll go to the preview where we see, you know, the much awaited Dispo versus Hit. And we can see now that one of the reasons that this Poe probably able to counter Hit's time skip is Kunsi, the the, uh, the blue the bluish member of Universe Eleven. And we are seeing uh, Son Goku turn into Super Saiyan God, today. and that's the God Key. Uh, they are not able to, you know, to locate, not necessarily locate, to detect the key, and he's probably saving his strength because he probably he knew that the end game is near against the strongest, and of course we still have yet to see Frieza in real action. Okay, so well, that's it. It was a fairly good episode, and. It's going to be another explosive episode next week, so let's wait and see and just enjoy, have fun watching. Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you in the next video.